Sabote, this is Jeff. And this is David. And we are still playing Equinox. Still in the Ice Palace. Uh, we are heading towards the green path. And that's not too much in the magic. Yes, wherein we will use all, all six of our green keys that we got in the red path. Yay. So make sure it's... Okay, still, yeah, still, it's still recording. recording. It's still Good. recording. Good. Goody. It will stop. Good. It could stop at any moment. <laughs> and it probably hey, will. Hey, look. Remember that other place where there was like a, a thing that raised up? Well, let's make it three times as complicated. Let's use a reveal spell. <laughs> That wasn't helpful at all. <laughs> what did that even... Did, that I think it even... was on the one on the bottom, or go forward from the way you're facing, then up one. Yeah, because it'll, it'll show you blocks that are that are hidden in some way. But this, as I will learn, has nothing to do with rising blocks, really. Most of it is hidden blocks. Oh, no. So, the there is one rising block. It's that very lower left one down there. I, I, will, I will get oh, around to it. Oh, man. I will get her. Glendall is nothing if not patient. Patient. I was going to say thorough. 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 Thorough is a good well, word. Well, thorough and yeah. patient. Go thorough, again. patient. They, they go and perfectionist. Maybe not that far. Um, oh, yes. As I, meant, I did mention this at the end of the uh, pirate ship video. I said that I would mention this, but I would probably forget, and I did until now. Uh, there are no more trolls. So even when we get our new weapon, we cannot get full life compared to magic. We will always have more magic than we have life. Is there no way to go back to a place where there's trolls? No. Once you're on the uh, the Skull Island, you're there. <laughs> you're just there. It's in game for you. That's it. Yeah. This is the one that rises up and down, and then. Oh hey. The invisible blocks. Okay, but where's the other invisible block? Let's do some deduction here using the mace as our reveal spell. So. Which Just jump up does. and shoot. Did it intersect anything? No, it didn't. Okay, so that's your clue that it's not where it is. There, it actually did intersect something. I did not notice it, though, <laughs> whilst playing. Uh, there we go. There, uh, I finally found it. Finally found it with my head. Uh, that is... Nice. So, we just need that. that is also at an angle. <laughs> not the expected angle. <laughs> All right. Of course. And then this one ends up being right next to the ghost now he doesn't drop anything so what you could have done was use the zap spell <laughs> awesome that was totally worth it well you needed to and just despite i will not use this, this zap spell just just so i was just like really really <sighs> well i don't know you could do it I... awesome little, little clutch there now you saw that we just passed the green gate yeah we will be going there except that I also need to find another token down here. This is a one-way trip, which means oh, there will be backtracking. Uh, we'll have to, get, like, there's a circle. It's basically, well, it's a rectangle. It's right. I mean, a square, really. It's a square. And then you like You cannot go out that way because you have to collect all the items in the room, which means you have to drop down. As you can see, I'm very low on magic. <laughs> yeah. spamming that, uh, which I will probably con I'll continue to do. Get rid of that ghost. Nothing? Oh. No, no. This, th I mean, for this will lead to a token, so it's not, uh, you know, it's not the worst thing. I mean, it's, it's necessary. It has yeah. to be done. Uh, but the most efficient way is, in the first video, when I said you can go left or right, you should have gone left. should have gone left. Because then you would have, yeah, you would have brought you here. You can get the token. And then this, this will start to turn, it will turn into familiar territory. And right. then at that point... Um, I'll actually just speed up the, as, okay. as, as I jog around the sort of do a lap and get back to the green door we saw. Uh, so don't fear, fear thee not. This will take forever as I try and figure out how to solve this stupid puzzle. Wow. It, it's invisible blocks or pushy blocks or something. So, to do it methodically, is there pushy blocks? Are they pushy blocks? That's the first thing to determine. Is the top a pushy block or is the bottom a pushy block? Or and you have to and, and you have to stay there longer than you think because it's as we've seen in previous dungeons. <laughs> it, is there a hidden block? No, there's not. Nope. Okay, so nope. no, there's. I've determined it's not a pushy block, and that was just a, a bad jump. There is a hidden block, as my mace is showing, that is in that empty space. You cannot make the jump to it from where we are now. So, then you have to wonder, how do I get past this? Uh, there is a solution, and I do find it. I'm gonna um, guess. Okay, go ahead and guess. 
There's a secret door somewhere here? There is no secret door. Okay. okay. You can do it with what you see here. There's nothing invisible. There's nothing okay. hidden. Um, I'm going to say... Right that? Like that. It's, just it's an angle. angle. Is an angled jump, and you can these these spikes are half a unit high. Because they're just rather spikes. rather than like large spikes. I guess large spikes would be like in Quagmire with the plants. Yeah. These are flat. These are flatter, which I guess means that it's a little bit easier to do an angle jump around them. And this place looks familiar. This is yeah, yep, a refreshing is, pause. We are going to increase the speed of the video drastically and have Glendall just you know jog. I'll just uh, ignore ignore that ignore that. It didn't happen. Okay. You didn't die. So yeah, well. Glendall's just going to jog around the outside. This we've all seen before. Yeah. Uh, there's no enemies. There's no tokens. There's nothing. It's just, just, go. just death traps. Just That will kill you. Yeah, just just to kill you. Because you've died twice, it looks like. Yeah, four times, uh, at least since I've gotten my health filled up again. Uh, I'm still pretty low on uh, magic, but it's okay. I'll, I'll be doing good uh, in a while here. We'll just continue the uh, sideshow. Uh, there's the green gate. All right, awesome. Refreshing pause. There we All go. All right. There now we, we will start the Green Gate a thon. The Green Gate a thon. Green Gate a thon. Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is another arm of the dungeon, so there will be six green gates in a row. Green gates. Green gates, and we will be finding uh, blue keys. We'll find six blue keys because it's radially symmetrical. It, this, you will do game? the same thing in each of these arms of the dungeon. So you gotta find six, 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 six keys. Yes, there will be twenty-four keys. In total, well, 24 keys you can get. 28 gates that need to be opened. There's a blue key. All right, so right now I'm just going back and forth looking for hidden blocks. Like I said, I don't remember the exact solution to all these. I'm, I'm figuring them out as I go. This this is a little bit more accurate to what a person actually, actually just playing the game, game. Yeah. will do. Uh, uh, aside from, you know, just quitting in frustration. Aside from quitting in frustration. Um, I do figure here, and it's logical that it has to do with, I mean, the pushy blocks there. Yeah. Uh, put them on my head, maybe. Nope. No, I don't put them on my head. Uh, then, and then the next solution I come up with, which is the right one, is to stack them. I mean, that's just the next logical thing to do. Oh, it is? Yeah, just push them together so that they stack when they fall on the edge. Oh. So then we have a little, uh, a little ladder, basically, that we can use. Well, so, sort of a ladder. We can use to climb up to the top. No pushy blocks. No, no invisible just, uh, blocks. Yeah, no invisible no. blocks, no spikes. Just, push, just yeah, just push them, and, and push. there you go, and you're done. And then use the zap spell, because even though I have no magic, I don't want to fight enemies, because I'm lazy. <laughs> and Glendall's lazy, too. Right. We have three falling blocks. Um, solution is, as as I guessed, pretty much right away, is going to be very similar. Stack to them just, on your yeah, head. Just, uh, well, no, you don't have to stack them, but you have to come in from the uh, lower left. And just push. Yeah, and just give them push, a good push. push. Yeah, that didn't quite push as far enough there. There we go. Look at that. Physics. What is physics? There's nothing to Glendall and his... His butt magic. And his... As, we, as, as we've discussed from, butt the, magic. The, the, from the previous video, his butt magic is used to propel him through the sky and then reset him on the floor occasionally 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 all right we have another key continue down the path uh we, you'll notice that each of these hallways has a different enemy type we're this is the blob hallway yeah and the other hallways had where you could shoot at them okay. yeah this this not so much oh, uh i don't really have enough to a yellow a white and a red right? yeah as a white and red i do not really have enough to use my zap spell um i want to save it for in, in case there's something Really annoying. Just something dumb. Yeah, something dumb, Just something annoying. Just dumb. Exactly. You know, I'd expect that not to be lined with blocks, but so you can go spikes. Well, it's also spikes. Now you can go left or right here. And you're you should have gone right, but I went left. Whatever. It, it's a big circle, uh, like the other end of the line for the. Because uh, we've we've opened all the gates now, mm -hmm. so we're at the uh, the circular area with the hidden rooms off to the side. It just makes it easier because, as you'll notice here, there's the one that there's the entrance you can see, and then there's a hidden entrance in each of these corner rooms, um, and it's always the hidden entrance that's going to be the one you need to go into for solutions. So. so it would just be more efficient if you went the right, right, the right path, so that if you're going clockwise, you'll find the right entrance first. And so you don't have to do basically you have to solve these puzzles twice. Uh, because you have to go all the way in, go to the secret entrance, and then it dumps you out at the non-secret entrance, etc., oh. etc. So it goes. Well, that's more spiky death. Not as mean as I thought it would be. No, not 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 entirely. Uh, there is. 
this is actually the this green the green path. I don't like it just because I had to do it so many times because I had to backtrack a few few times. Yeah. Uh, but it's not hard at all. Uh, I'm assuming it's just to make a few. An angle jump or yeah. Just, just there's there'll be an angle jump. Uh, it's just an easy angle jump. It's yeah. very very simple. Just. Uh, but I did want to see maybe there was a this is an investigational jump. No, there's there's not. Nope, nothing there. Not. Nothing there there's at all. The, 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 still worth it to yeah, <laughs> to it's see worth ex exploration. Yeah, exploration. For that the was sake one of, of few intentional deaths. Well, I mean, not intentional death, and I jumped intentionally. I think. Hope there would be something there. Uh, all right, the, find another key here. Just jump on top of this. It's I'm just looking for hidden blocks. There's none to be found. Uh, this actually just moves back and forth. Uh, an angle jump off of the very edge. Or not even angle jump. As long as it's at the uh, left. Yeah, and you catch the edge. No big deal. All right. uh, that's uh, at this point in the game, you should be. Really Very good, good at, at doing that kind of thing. Because otherwise, how did you get this? Mark? Yes, and you're probably cheating. Yeah. Or you probably yes another another clutch victory against incorporeal something something specter geist ghost whatever. Hey, do these push or do they not push? Is there a hidden block? There's no hidden block. So there's a token. Do you need? Have we push the block. You just jump we over push that the block? Spike? No, no, that is not a jump that can be made. Huh. Uh, these are not pushy blocks, though. They're not. Not at all. Not at all. I'm going to assume that there are invisible blocks above the spikes? Uh, yes, there is an, there's an invisible block above a spike. Oh, one of them. One of them. Uh, just... Not the ones that are on the ground here, though. Oh. Uh, this is also going to be the part where... Oh, look. You can just... Yeah, you can see I'm just going through it. I'll eventually find that my mace stops, so there's a hidden block there. So you just need to jump top. Get our token. Hey, it would be really great if I got the hidden weapon in that room, but I didn't, so we're going to be doing backtracking later. Amazing. <laughs> and there's no point to get the weapon, because it's absolutely crappy. It's the double sword? Yeah, double sword. You know how much the original sword was great. Yeah. So it's like a slower version of the mace, but that sometimes doesn't shoot forward. So sometimes it just wastes it by shooting backwards. You don't need it. That, by the way, is not where I thought it was. That was, <laughs> it was slightly off. It was slightly off. It is a little bit lower. This, yeah, where I'm shooting now. That is the direction you need to jump to get to wow. it. Wow. It is just being mean. I, this it's game, just being mean. This, that is all. This game makes my head hurt. <laughs> we're we're almost done with the circle at the end of the uh, the green path. There's a there's another hidden block there, uh, but to be thorough, I'm gonna go ahead and use the mace to check. Well, well, I mean, obviously, I didn't know where the hidden block was to begin with, so I just start at the bottom, continue shooting maces, and then it's yeah, it's just right here, where what where it's sort of like where it was in the uh, the, other you know, the token room, or the hidden weapon room, which again, I mean, they're giving you so many apples and not so many potions. Yeah, not so many. Once again, this from this direction. <laughs> was, hey, about about when did you realize you'd made a mistake? Hey, look at that! I made that jump. Hey. Well, I mean, it was just slightly more inconvenient, but what are you hey. gonna do? I mean, I realized about halfway through, so you know, it wouldn't have mattered. Explodey block, explodey block, explodey block. Can I make it? Oh, of course I can. All right. Yay! Simple jump off the side. We now have uh, all the all the all the keys. The blue quarter will be open to us now. Wait. Why did those respawn? Oh, because you didn't. I didn't kill all of them. That's why they respawn. They will be killed later when I return, <laughs> because that, of uh, my irresponsible backtracking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just get my stupid weapon. Nobody likes the twin sword. They're stupid. You know, you didn't have to go back and get it. Like they are literally stupid. They have a low and even for an inanimate object, their intelligence is low. So that's what I'm trying to say. No, it's a, it's a sword. Now just a peaceful stroll through the green hallways, because there's actually no more enemies or spikes now that the enemies have been killed once. Um, at, least, at least the red hallway had a bunch of, you know, slidey block puzzle trap things. Now, of course, this nothing compared to the blue hallway, Which is the blue where, path. Which is where we're about to start, I'm yeah. thinking. Well, we, in, in the next part, we will see... I, I will end in front of the blue gate in this part. Uh, and then I will think I will briefly consider going into Blue Gate, realize I'm missing a weapon, and then we will backtrack. 
So the start of the next video will be really fast backtracking. Awesome. Uh, but yeah, so look forward to that. Yeah. yeah. And stick my head on that. Yeah, that's great. <laughs> it's just, it's just really good. Just you know, stick the turban on there and just ride it yeah. out. Yeah. There's the blue gate. Uh, this is the pushy block you used to get over there. Uh, the white gate we will see a few videos from now, but. Yeah. Uh, this is the end of this part. We'll be doing some backtracking to Shall grab a I? new weapon on the next part of Let's Play Equinox.